Over the past few weeks, Hong Kong police have turned to firing tear gas to disperse crowds. Such assaults have driven up the demand for gas masks and other equipment that protesters use for protection. Here in Taiwan, retailers report that sales of gas mask cartridges have shot up since the protests began. The retailers say that many buyers appear to be Hong Kongers who snap up dozens of units of defensive equipment at a time. As Hong Kong's anti-extradition bill protests escalate, demand has increased for gear to protect against tear gas fired by police. Here in Taiwan, the demand has brought up sales of gas masks and filters. Half-mask respirators have become a must for people taking to the streets in Hong Kong. This retailer used to sell no more than 100 such masks in a year. Since protests started, it sold 500 a month. Recently, we've been getting Hong Kongers every few days. They come to the company and buy masks and cotton filter products. Almost all of them bring suitcases. They buy 20 to 30 units at a time. Before, only around 300 gas mask cartridges would be sold in a year. Since the protest began, more than 2,000 have been sold. Some varieties are sold out, like the number 502 filter retainer, which will not be available until a shipment arrives from the U.S. in November. If you add up the sales from gas masks, gas mask cartridges, filter retainers and cotton filters, then in the space of just one month, we made almost 1 million NT. Meanwhile, demand for other protective gear like goggles has also shot up. But despite the surge in sales, many Taiwan retailers still say they'd rather see the situation in Hong Kong de-escalate soon.